to be, but that next song is the song, The Lighthouse, and what God has for us. I just called Gene this week and said, would you mind doing the prayer today? And the Lord spoke to his heart and prepared you for what the next step is. There's a lot of darkness we're going to talk about today in the sermon. This is probably, in fact, I'm pretty sure it's the most uh, evil, sinful, uh, wretched bowl of garbage you'll find in scripture and there's some bad areas there but it's all kind of piled into one thing right in the middle of a beautiful story about Jesus and his disciples and we're going to look at that today but you look to the light and we'll see how that fits in and shines through the the garbage we'll talk about it in a moment the lighthouse now there's a lighthouse on a hillside that overlooks life when I'm tall sends out a light that I might see and the light that shines in darkness now will safely lead a soul if it wasn't for the lighthouse my ship would be no more and I thank God for the lighthouse I owe Jesus is a lighthouse, and from the rocks of sin, He has shown a light around me that I could clearly see. If it wasn't for the lighthouse, where would this ship be? Oh, everybody that lives around us says tear the lighthouse down they say the big ships don't sail this way anymore there's no use in it standing brown but then my mind goes back to the stormy night when just in time i saw the light it's the light from that old lighthouse that stands there on the hill and I thank God for the lighthouse I owe my life to Him for Jesus is the lighthouse and from the rocks of sin He has shown a light around me that I could clearly see I thank God for the lighthouse I owe my life to Him For Jesus is the lighthouse And from the rocks of sin He has shown a light around me That I could clearly see If it was for the lighthouse, where would this ship be? Yes, if it was for the lighthouse, tell me where would this ship be? 